I watched the documentary My Big Fat Body and this main actor Frank Payne he for sure is overweight he weighs more than 120 kilograms and he's like clinically obese in a really bad state and his eating habits are pretty bad mostly what he eats are pizzas and burgers but it's nothing bad compared to what the doctors are saying like this lady over here you can hear what she says <laughs> I hate that. So normally an adult is supposed to consume 2,000 calories a day if you're physically active. This so she just said an adult is supposed to eat 2,000 calories a day if he's an active. Like can you imagine saying to this guy who is really overweight to eat 2,000 calories a day and to be active, very active. It is crazy. Even me, I weigh 75 kilograms and if I would just lie all day, do totally nothing, I would burn more than 2000 calories. So how can a doctor suggest to this guy to eat 2000 calories a day? And plus, he's supposed to be active if he eats 2000 calories. Can you imagine what diets are following these doctors that are supposed to bring health to the society it is totally crazy like a person who weighs 120 kilograms if he doesn't eat some 4500 5000 calories a day of course he is going to have big problems and basically what they they say in this video is that like you are eating too much in one day he eats um, 15,000 calories and they suggest him to eat 2,000 calories. This pizza has 3,100 calories. This pizza has 3,500 calories. So you're already close to 7,000 calories. Three days worth of food just with those two pizzas in one sitting. Now you would also consume four double cheeseburgers. Correct. The calorie content of that is 2680. That sandwich alone is 630 calories. The chicken is 2900 calories. The ice cream, 2320 calories. You're consuming 15,150 calories. When in a day you're supposed to consume 2000 calories. It means that from Friday night to Saturday, you're essentially putting on four pounds. So this four pounds of fat so basically she says that he each day gains four pounds of fat I'm not sure like two kilograms maybe or something like that the problem with these doctors they are not even talking about the carbohydrate and fat amount for example if we open chronometer we can see that if you eat 3000 grams like three kilograms of potatoes you will get two and a half thousand calories and from all these calories um, six percent of these calories are coming from fat and if we change this thing if we put in I don't know what we can add um, McDonald's burger McDonald's cheeseburger, let's select and select 10 burgers okay let's select 8 if you eat 8 burgers which will be 2,500 calories then 39% of the calories are coming from fat so they don't even think about that if you eat fatty food you're gonna get fat do you think that if a person follows for a month, one strict month following certain diet, for example eating only potatoes for one month, every day eating potatoes, for sure this person is going to be lean and he's not going to gain any weight. But the person who is eating McDonald's the same amount of calories and 40% of fat coming from the calories 
it's like of course he is going to gain weight because he is eating much more fat than a person on potato diet so they are not talking about about fat amounts about carbohydrates in this case they should suggest him to eat as much as he wants but just give good good food like no fat carbohydrates fruits vegetables all the grains you can make really nice dishes and it would be much better option than what they are suggesting to him to restrict calories eat little little piece of meat little piece of vegetable and make a diet like that it is not going to work and what the doctors are suggesting is totally horrible so don't listen to the doctors listen to like your rational ideas can you imagine people who are getting fat from fruits and vegetables it is impossible you can eat as much fruits and vegetables and grains as you like to don't put oil there don't pour the oil inside the food and for sure you are going to be lean and just eat as much as you wish to so go vegan peace see you later